Hi and welcome to my light sensor circuit. This circuit makes a perfect project for anyone studying at school that's just starting electronics. In order to make a light sensor circuit, we need something that can sense light, a component that can sense light. And the component I'm going to use is the LDR. LDR stands for Light Dependent Resistor. You can see from the LDR that I'm using that its resistance changes from about 1K in a fully lit room to uh, 500K when it's fully dark with my hand closed over it. In this part of the circuit, I've connected the LDR to a 470 kilo ohm resistor. It's a variable resistor, and this allows me to tune the LDR and the voltage across the LDR. And you'll notice on the oscilloscope, the voltage moving up and down as I put my hand over the LDR and take it away from the LDR. Next, we connect a potentiometer, and the middle point of the potentiometer will be used to set a steady voltage level, like so. So we've got a varying voltage and we've got a steady voltage. And you'll be able to see on the oscilloscope that the steady voltage of course always stays steady and the varied one will rise above it and below it. And we can use this property, if you like, to make a simple electronic circuit using a component known as a comparator. For this circuit, we're going to use an LM311 comparator, and you can see on the video how it's connected, and you can also see in Multisim how it's all connected together. In Multisim, I use a potentiometer to model the LDR and a variable resistor above it. Both are 470K ohms, and I use a 5K potentiometer for the steady voltage. The voltage from the LDR, that's the midpoint of the LDR, and the voltage from the potentiometer are fed to pins 2 and 3 of the comparator. The inputs of the comparator are called the inverting and non-inverting inputs. The inverting input has a minus sign next to it, and the non-inverting input has a positive sign next to it. If, for example, I connect the steady voltage, the threshold voltage, to the non-inverting input. Every time the varying voltage goes above the non-inverting input, the output will switch off, and when it falls below, it will switch on. If I change the inputs around, the reverse will happen, as you can see on the video. I change both inputs around, and at one point when I put my hand over the LDR, the light comes on. And when I take it away, it switches off. I provided a breadboard plan here that you can use to build the circuit if you wish or you can try and build it from the schematic that I included from Multisim. That's all you need to be able to do in order to build this circuit. If you are gonna build it, I hope you have fun building it, and I hope it works, and goodbye, good luck.